Good morning, America. I'm Fire. And I'm Ice. And we have breaking news today about heating and cooling particles. To Caleb and Carter with more information. Today we will be experimenting with how varying temperatures affects the air particles in a water bottle. We will put one in an oven, we will put one in a freezer, and the other is our control. We will just leave that at room temperature and we'll see what happens. Okay. This is an after shot of the Propel bottle after we took it out of the oven. As you can see, it got bigger and it got a bulge on the bottom. That is because the air molecules inside the bottle expanded, making it bigger. So here we have the day two of the bottle we put in the freezer. And, yeah. All right, okay, so here, the bottle caved in on itself because the molecule inside the bottle got cold so they shrunk and came together, which caused the bottle to cave in on itself and be sucked in. Here is an experiment to show how particles heat up and cool down. So you see the wax stuff at the bottom, it makes the heat makes the particles move apart, which makes it lighter, so then it floats up to the top. And then when it's up here, it cools down, so it makes the particles move closer together, which makes it denser, so that it falls back down. Wow, that was fantastic. Now for our next experiment. Okay, here we have warm molecules, and when the molecules get heated up and they become warm, they spread out, and they like go everywhere. Here is cold molecules in this circle. And they're cold, so they come together, so they can stay warmer. Okay, so right now we have a solid piece of ice, and the molecules are tightly packed. And we're going to put it in boiling water and see what happens. This is the ice melted. So the molecules are getting more spread out because of the heat and turns into a liquid, and then it turns into a gas. All right, so let's recap. When a bottle is heated up, it expands. And when it, when it freezes, it shrinks. And our lava life experiment showed us that when molecules heat up, they float apart and go up, and then when they cool down, they condense and fall back down. That was some amazing science. We'll see you next week, America. I'm Fire. And I'm Ice. Let's recap. When a bottle is heated up, it will shrink. Really? Alright guys, this is an after shot of the bottle after we got it out of the oven. As you can see, it got bigger and longer and it looks like it's pregnant now. No, you explain it. <laughs> Redo that. Alright guys, this is an after shot of what happened when we put it in the oven. As you can see, the bottle got bigger and it got a bulge on the bottom. That's because the air molecules inside got heated <laughs> up and expanded. What are you doing? Why are you ruining it? <laughs> mm.